Hello YouTube, uh, Spade MC Gamer here, and uh, today I'm back with another mod installation tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install the Enchantment View mod, uh, version 3.8.0 for Minecraft 1.5.1. And um, this mod basically shows you your, what enchantment you are going to uh, invest in on your item. And um, as you can see right there, it shows you. So when you hover over it, it actually, it basically all it does is translate the uh, the uh, the the writing in the enchantment table. And um, so I know it's, it might be a little bit cheaty but I, I think it's a very good mod because it takes so long to get like a level 30 enchantment and to get it all wasted on something like Bane of a Taurus is just like the worst feeling ever so I think it is a worthwhile mod and I, I'm definitely going to use it in my let's play but um, anyway um, how to install it uh, you want to go to the link in the description which will be this page this forum page and um, the bomb Zen's mods and um, once you get here just scroll down and hit the enchantment view mod is like second or third on the page because he has a few different mods and um, as you can see right here it says underneath it says requires minecraft forge or mod loader also requires the bomb zen the i don't know how to really pronounce the bob the bomb zen api i think i'm saying it right the bomb zen api and then the mod itself so it does require a lot for a little mod but if you have any other mods in your minecraft you probably will have minecraft forge already installed so if you have minecraft forge or mod loader already installed all you have to do is download these two right here the bomb zen api and the download enchantment view but if you don't have any mods or anything and um, we're going to use minecraft forge you can use mod loader if you know if you want to use that one but we're going to use forge just because it makes it compatible with other mods quite easy and uh, just it, minecraft forge is quite easy to install as well so first thing you want to do is click the minecraft forge in blue right there uh, that'll bring you to um, a minecraft forge web page um, the Minecraft Forge and uh, just once you go down you'll see downloads add fly downloads direct click direct universal right there and it'll download automatically so just downloads direct universal and it should download automatically so once you have that downloaded uh, go back to the to the uh, page and you need oh sorry I'm gonna pass it gone past the mod here uh, you need uh, the bombs in API once you, when you click that blue link it actually brings you down the page to where he has it here uh, so this is just past this is actually just a few bit just a little scroll down the page and you can see it right here uh, the bombs in for minecraft 1.5.1 uh, just see right here it says download the bombs in API when you click that and um, it brings you to an ad fly link and right here in the top right hand corner it says please wait three two one seconds not the one here in the top right hand corner and just press skip ad once you press skip ad it da it'll download automatically so um that's sound and uh, next you want to get the actual mod itself just so just go back to the uh to the mod page itself and uh, back to where you see the downloads on the mod right here and see it says download enchantment view client mod and that's exactly the same as the bomb bomb zen api and um, so it's just an ad fly link click skip ad and it'll download so once you have the three downloads i know they're quite tricky to get because they're all over the place on the page but just do what i showed you there and you should get them no problem so once you have the three downloads uh, you should have them like this the enchantment view mod the bomb zen api and minecraft forge so next you want to go to your windows icon and in the search bar type percentage mark app data percentage mark so that's a percentage mark a p p d a t a percentage mark just click enter and you should see a folder here called dot minecraft you want to go inside your dot minecraft folder next you want to go inside your bin folder then you want to uh, go down to a file or folder where you see minecraft code it might say minecraft.jar it'll be an executable jar file it should be the biggest one here if your minecraft is not modded already uh, so minecraft.jar uh, and you want to open left click then right click open with winrar archiver now if you don't have winrar archiver or any archiving program look up on youtube winrar for free trial and you can get a free trial that's what i use and um, it works perfect and as you can see because it's a free trial it asks you to buy winrar but all you have to do is exit out of that uh, once you open up winrar or open up minecraft.jar with winrar you want to delete the meta inf folder straight away the one in capital letters it says m-e-t-a-i-n-f delete that folder straight away so delete the meta inf folder um, first you want to uh, open minecraft forge and just wait a second and then you want to right click select all files drag and drop inside your minecraft.jar press ok then you can exit out of minecraft forge and move that to the side because we have that one finished with <laughs> next you want to open the bomb zen api 
and just select uh, the four files inside there, drag and drop inside here, press OK. And then last but not least you want to open the, uh, the enchantment view mod. So just select all them files inside there as well, drag and drop inside your minecraft.jar, press OK. And that's it guys, that's all you have to do, drag the three uh, downloads into your minecraft.jar, delete metainf and you're good to go. So once you're finished you can exit out of them windows and run your minecraft. I just log in right here. As you can see, Minecraft Forge downloads uh, new files that you need. Um, it'll take a second, so you can just let that download away. So we should wait a second now. It hopefully won't take too long. My internet is quite bad, guys, so apologies if it takes probably longer than most people. Most people have better internet than me. Um, yeah, okay, this should be the last, last load up. Okay, I know there is a lot of work in this mod, like there's three, there's three downloads for just a small mod, but I really do think it's worth it, because do, um, like, getting all that time to level 30 and then not getting a good enchantment really is, uh, really is bad, you know, I, I, I think it's terrible, I don't know why you can't see the enchantments that you're getting, it's, I just don't, I think it doesn't make sense, but um, yeah, I think it makes a lot, this mod is a really, really handy little mod, and I'm definitely going to include it in my Let's Play. So as you can see it says right there, 6 mods loaded, 6 mods active. I have mods right here, I'll click into the Minecraft, Minecraft Forge, Minecraft Mod Loader, um, Mod, the Bonzen API, Mod Enchantment View, Enchantment View Server, so it's all there, all the stuff you need. And I have a little world just made here with a, with a table in it already, a crafting or a enchantment table. So as you can see my levels are at 60, and I just go in here, right click, drag my bow inside, and Boom, there you can see, I can see what I want to get. So if I go like so, get another one, power four, flame four, or flame one even, just flame one, like that's pretty bad for a level 30. You can get flame one on like 18, I think, or something like that. Power three and flame one, not too bad. And um, power one, flame one, infinity. We'll go with that one, even though I have a really good bow here already, but same with a sword, I'll put it in here right here. Sharpness two, three, knockback two, not bad. Looting two, knockback two. Knockback 2, Fire Aspect 2, Sharpness 3, Looting 2. As you can see guys, it just makes, you just get way better um, weapons out of it. And uh, it's just like, it's just so much better, you know. There's really no point in wasting all them levels. So um, yeah guys, that's going to be it for this video. Um, do please leave a like if this if you enjoyed or if this helped you in any way. And also subscribe to lots uh, for lots more videos like this in the future. I do lots of different Minecraft Let's Plays and uh, stuff like that. So if you want to see my Let's Play with this mod, um, there'll be an annotation on the screen right now. Go check it out there. Otherwise, um, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.